welcome to episode 11 of, uh, of Snug Radio's Retro Lounge. And um, I really, I shouldn't have started it like that because tonight we're doing horror games. Uh, now I got a bunch together and there's enough to do horror games to the sequel. But that'll probably be on October, maybe. Um, so we're going to look at 8-bit, 16-bit games that have got some sort of horror inflection. I would say. Um, we're going to play them in... Well, actually, we'll probably play them in alphabetical order by system. Just because that's the way the list is sorted. But who knows? We might jump around. You know what this show's like. Uh, so I need to um, get down there uh, so you can see this screen. Okay. Oh, we're not playing Donkey Kong, though, are we? There we go. It's gone. Uh, right. Um... So, we're starting off, at, as, as quite often often happens in these things, we're going to start off uh, with the Atari 2600. And, believe it or not, now you can hear it going in the back. Oh, oh, what's that I hear you ask? Well, let me hijack the screen for you and you'll be able to see. Um, because... The um, the Atari was kind of the Wild West when it came out. There's all sorts of games that um, childlike minds shouldn't see, shall we say. Um, but there was a game based on the film Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Yes. Texas Chainsaw Massacre on the Atari 2600. Um, so, let me make sure my pad is working. And we'll see what this game's all about. I've not played it. Uh, run it once to see um, whether it worked or not. Edit game controls. Pick the doobry doobry. That's this, the doobry doobry. Okay, probably leave that open because uh, it's a little fickle. Alright, how do we start this? Not that one. What about that one? Okay. Um. Okay, well, I guess I'm Leatherface. Oh, I'm trapped. Can't move. Alright, do I. Did that. What was that peeping noise? Oh, right. I guess I am. Um, oh, can I? Ch oh, I can chainsaw through them, then, but then they run away. Whoa! There you go. And I guess you try not to run out of fuel. Oh. So, oh, goodness gracious. Can we get another? Oh, whoa! Nope. Wait, where are you going? Yeah, shit back. There we go. So, a game where you chainsaw teens to pieces. Um, as leather. F oh, I've ran out of fuel. Shall we try the other way? It's. It's. I mean. Oh. It's a weird one to understand. Um, I'm not sure why. Why it's got like. Things for horses to jump over, or I understand the bushes, and you are in Texas, so you've got the cow schools. So, y yes, come on, do you have to wait for them to squeak? And there was somebody in a wheelchair in um, oh, one right, squeaking. Surely I can get you now. Come on. Stop running away from me. No, out of fuel again. I don't know. Oh, I, I can't just escape them. I have to cut out. Right. I thought I could just wait. I thought it was like a delay thing. 
Okay, come on, don't run away from me this time. Oh. Rebel scum. What's... Is there, is there something I'm missing? Gotcha. Oh. Nothing worse than a wheelchair in the head. Okay, one last one before... Oh. Oh, I see. She just kicks me up in the ass. All right. All right. And that's it, is it? That's the end? Yep. Mmm. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. <sighs> I think we should have another go and see if we can beat 4,000. Let's see what happens. Can't just play again for one minute, can we? Oh, it's going to be a lot longer than that if I keep running into wheelchairs. Squealer, we've got a squealer. No, don't let her escape. Oh, come on. She wasn't the one that was squealing, though, was she? A different colour. What if I just chase her for a bit? My fuel doesn't go down, does it? Do I chase her till she squeals? Or do I get her from... Get her from below. That's what I do. Okay. <sighs> Wasting my fuel on bushes. Oh, for God's sake. Well, the first one went so well. Kinda. Oh, these wheelchairs. Get out of it. <laughs> Don't think I've really got enough fuel to... Um... Yeah, thanks, chat room. Uh, yes. For a horror game, it's not very scary. I, I, I do appreciate that. Um, and tonight, you might not, it might not be as scary as, you know, as you expect. But they all, all these games do have a horror basis. Uh, this woman is getting on my nerves. Boo. So not as good as last time. But I think that's enough Texas Chainsaw Massacre. That's just to get us warmed up. Um, so we're going to move to the NES. We've got a couple of games from the NES. Uh, and we're going to start... We're going to start with Nightmare on Elm Street. Yes, Nightmare on Elm Street for the NES nearly was in our Movie Tie-Ins episode. But I thought I'd save it for the, um, for the horror episode. So... What sort of game is this going to be like? I mean, I assume some of you watching this will have already played it. But I never had an S. And uh, just looking at these games that we're playing tonight, I don't... I think I've only ever played one of them before. And that's probably our last game that we'll play tonight. There's this weird thing where I have to change the settings so that it actually lets it get hijacked and then I have to change them again for the next one and change them again alright let's make it a little bigger on the uh, on the old CRT hmm I think that's too big alright let's see how we got on with that Bum, 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 b
Dead. Oh, now I'm alive again. Um. Okay. So I can't get that. Do I have to... Get it like that. Can I punch these? No, apparently not. Oh, just dead. Oh, shit. Bit disturbing that he, uh, when he dies, he puts on a uh, an angel miniskirt. How do I? I'm trying to get down. Why do I, I let go down? Do I need something to get? Oh. Frig! Come on! I can't get down there, even though there's an arrow that says, go down here. So, have I lost? Have I forgetting something? <sighs> Eat that. Not doing any good, like. But... Oh! I just have to be patient. We've talked about this before, haven't we? Jump, jump over, punch up his, punch him from behind. Oh, angel miniskirt. his life. Yes, those hands could do with a pedicure, a manicure. I think you have to call it a personally cure nowadays, though. I can't see where he's... I guess it's the one above, is it? Still don't know how I'm gonna get out of here though. Oh, you people, you people at home will be watching going. Uh, is that is that the sound of me getting out? Is it is it is it? Right. Oh, 
Oh, thank you, Nutty Cluster, for cheering another 100 bits. Oh, what's happened there? What's going on? Guess I'm jumping over them. No, I'm not. I'm walking straight into them and dying. Whoa! Ah, you shitbag. Guess I don't need all of them. Am I going to regret that? Oh, I can't get out. Can't get out. Ah. Maybe I do need that one. Can I get out now? Let me out. It's like a nightmare. Oh! Crap! Didn't expect that. Another boss. So soon. Where am I, how am I supposed to? No, I can't touch it. I'll jump on it. Well, that's not good. How many continues I'm gonna get? Alright, so it's. Oh, that music's driving me mad. Come on, a couple more hits. Not on me. Rah, didn't think I was going to manage that, but yeah, rah. Now, nah, fuck it, I'm jumping over him. Oh, what? How did I get in that other house and why can't I get in this one? Well, the door's even open. Hmm. Don't know. Let's try another house. What's the ticking down for? I'm gonna want them, aren't I? Probably. Oh, I ate that. I really ate that. Guess I'm in nightmare land. What do I need from down here? Why have you put me a lift? 
when there's nothing to get. Oh, you annoying skull-headed freaks. Okay, game over. Don't think you want to see me play that again. Nightmare on Elm Street. Um, if possible, I might have another crack at that. Another later on down the line, perhaps. Now that I know what I'm doing. <sighs> All right. Let's move on to our second uh, NES game. This is called Zombie Nation. Um, so, what's Zombie Nation all about? Well, my guess will be zombies, but we'll find out. Um, almost definitely not based on the superb TV show Z Nation. Um. Oh, I'm just I'm gonna leave it where it is. I'm gonna leave it where it is. Yeah. Okay. So, what goes on on Z Nation? Sorry, Zombie Nation. Hmm. Oh, locks. Right. Okay. It looks Japanesey to me. Zombie Nation. <laughs> Appeared to be a harmless meteorite crashing into the Nevada desert. Nevada didn't look very Nevada-y, I'll be honest with you. I'm expecting it to say something about Japan later. Uh, are you you read you you're keeping up with this? Because I'm not reading it out. kind of feel there's so much of it that possibly you need to know some. So we're in Nevada but we, there's nothing more powerful than the legendary samurai sword. Okay. So... We're recapturing a magical sword and free the US from the evil clutches of dark with a C seed. Alrighty then. Oh, Samurai Zombie Nation on this screen, right? How do we play? What are we playing? We're playing it easy, whatever we're playing. Yes, yes indeed. No, easy, easy. Do we get to choose? No, nope, we're going to America. Okay, so what to... Uh, oh! Right, so I have a fire... Rate. Oh, do I... Do I... Right. So, I appear to be Rampage and grabbing little people as they jump out. So it's very Rampage. Um, so why am I a big Japanese head? Mix. I don't understand. Oh, oh I'm dead! I think that's Japanese for fucking hell. Right, that didn't last very long, did it? Um, yes, we shall continue. Do I have any other buttons? No, just these two buttons. Uh, sorry, I've got two buttons, but only one of them does anything. So it plays a little bit. I mean, it is rampagey, but it also plays a little bit like our type, um, where you're traveling from left to right and shooting. And I kind of feel that this one would benefit from a turbo button. I 
mean, I don't see anywhere to read, like, anything to... Do they give you your life back or something? There must be a reason to collect the little fellas as they fall off. I've not seen any zombies yet, though. Unless it's some Japanese translation issue. And I guess it's got a bit of defender in it as well with the uh, bloody little fellas dropping out and you have to rescue them. guys dropping from they are parachuting or something whoa oh oh how am I gonna get over that I'm not perhaps you mean to move faster oh game over it ends so quick where would I continue from do you reckon Oh, so soon. Let's try again. I think we need to be right, right up close like this. What are those bloody gribbly things sitting on the side? Oh dear. I don't know if I can get past these bloody. Mm. These are the problem continues. Right. These ones that have to start high up, okay, it's not too bad. But is there some sort of trigger for them that can turn them off? Who's shooting me? Oh, it's already switched on, isn't it? So, how do, oh, does it? Right, okay. Are they timed then? Is there a. Oh, get through quick. Oh. Oh, we might as well use all our continues. Even though it didn't make no sense. <laughs> At least now I know it's a timing issue, I can just sit and be careful. Oh, no, maybe I can't be... No, no! All right. I can't sit and wait. She get pushed along. I'm running out of health. I'm running out of health. I call the Japanese for oh shit. <laughs> well, there you go. Not a lot to it. But um, appears there might be a lot of Japanese backstory to that. Uh, 
Samurai Zombie Nation. Didn't see any samurais. Or zombies. Tonight's beverage of choice. Uh, vanilla Coke Zero. With um, yeah, maybe a splash of Kahlua in it. Alright, that's, that's enough of that. Enough of Zombie Nation. Uh, all right. Okay. So, we're moving on to the DS. Um, for our... And, and it's... I've run this to, um, to see how it plays and whether it plays all right, because it's the DS, and it doesn't emulate very well. But it plays like shit. And um, in all honesty, in fact, to tell you what I do, I'm going to switch to the vertical screen to, to give you all a better chance. But what's going to happen is... Uh, oh, I need to add a source. Don't have a source for this one. One sec. Uh, mm, source. Okay. So. It, it, it plays horribly. But it's the only Resident Evil um, game that I have available. So. We need it under that one. There we go. And we need to hijack the right window so you can see it. Nope, it's not there. Change the settings. Here we are. Right, so. Still, still a bit big. That's what she said. Let's have a look. Okay. So it's going to look a little weird because it's on a... Part of me just wants to, to grab the bottom screen because the bottom screen is where the action is. The top screen is just information. But um, I left it in primarily for the acting, for you to enjoy... Uh, the acting because by Jiminy well anyway so um, there might be things you need to see on the bottom oh, bloody different screen sizes I have ask you there we go um, so Oh, what's rebirth mode? I'm always worried about doing a, one of the new modes on a DS because it generally needs a stylus. Let's do classic. Evil. I mean, that might be by it plays like shit. Um, yep, yeah, no choice for easy, which, as we all know, is is my preferred play. So let's go with Jill, who's normal. Well, it's open for debate. Now the sun's streaming through, so you'll have to excuse me. It's not not very scary. Nineteen ninety-eight, July. Alpha Team is flying around the forest zone, situated in northwest Raccoon City, where we're searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo Team, who disappeared during the middle of our mission. Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are it's good when it reads out itself, isn't it? I'd have to do it. By a group of about ten people. Cause quite often I don't. The victims were apparently eaten. Bravo team went to the hideout of the group and disappeared. Look, Chris. Look, Chris. Oh, 
Actually, let's try my ice cream a little bit bigger for you while it's doing its... Uh... Oh, sorry, I've just spoiled the flow of the story. Pfft. We'll move it back down in a sec. It was Bravo Team's helicopter. Nobody was in it. But strangely, most of the equipment was still there. However, we soon discovered why. What you're sc seeing on screen, all oh, shrunk down, looks a lot better than what I'm looking at. Look at that. Hey, video. Oh, I probably should say this is Resident Evil Deadly Silence. And I didn't watch this when I tested it. I just click, 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 click straight into the game. So I haven't seen this either. Didn't look very scared then, did she? I have watched full length films with similar acting to this. No, don't go. Oh, if I'm not careful, I've finished all my clue before uh, the game's even started. Sorry, chat room. This uh, this overlay doesn't have a, a chat window yet, and every time I switch, I lose all the chat for some reason. If anyone could tell me how to sort that out. Oh, plaster cast. Jill Valentine. Oh, that was a, oh, you, type look. Dear, dear. Resident Evil. Resident Evil. Okay, we're off into the mansion. What is this? Wow, what a mansion. Captain Wesker, where's Chris? Stop it. Don't open that door. Don't open but that Chris door. Is. What is it? <laughs> Maybe it's Chris. Now, Jill, can you go? I'm going with you. Chris is our old partner, you know. Okay, let me handle this. I still don't know who's going. Uh, Stay see. alert. Okay. Are we gaming for gaming now? Is it actually happening? So what I found with this is no matter which way your character's facing, forward or up is always forward. So at the moment, if I turn right, She's looking to her right, but it's my left. But if I turn around, so it's like I'm always going in circles with her because she doesn't don't stay where I want. Oh. Now, if I want to look at that. Oh, there's nothing inside. Disappointing. But anyway, so instead of going right to make a walk off the screen like like that way, because I'm mirrored, so I'm looking the wrong way now as well. I I, I, I press forward. What? What is this? What is it? Looks what like green it? goo. Blood. It's not blood. Jill, see if you can find any other clues. I'll be examining this. Oh. Hope yeah, it's... this is not Chris's blood. I hope so too, as he's very ill. You're just going to inspect a pile of... A, a pool of blood. Right. So I'm uh, I'm walking backwards now. I'm walking the wrong direction. So oh, oh, 
bloody circle. Thought, yeah, I didn't really have any intention on playing this a lot. Because uh, it's just so difficult to control. And if I ever run into anything, I, I'm, I'm effed. Proper effed. Um, so you can... You press start and you've got stuff. No, so... No. So let's do a quip. Okay. Uh, exit. Right, now I've got a shooty shooter. How do I use it? Oh. Okay, so... Don't know what that is. Is that a knife? So one assumes that one of these... Don't have a shooty button. Okay, let's walk down. Down this way. Do I have to hold that to fire then? Oh, up, oh, down. Okay, no, no, walk in, walk in. Oh, uh oh. Gonna find out how to shoot now, aren't I? Oh no, is that... Now, why Why is Chris's blood red there? Don't get it. Oh, oh, oh. Eat, 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 lad. Rebel scum. Okay. Oh! I perhaps should get away from him. Oh, I won't get away from him walking around in circles, will I? Is there anything I need to inspect in these games? Super. Can I can I inspect Chris? Is it Chris? No, it's still a picture of the mansion. Perhaps I need to walk around this way a little bit and no, not walk this way. Oh, that's it. Walk that way. Oh, he's Kenneth. He's not Chris. Well, few. That's all right. Now he's become a mere shadow of his former self. Or dead, as we say in the biz. Okay. Yeah, back away. Back away, Jill. So there isn't anything there. That's the door I came in it. What's this one? It's locked. It's locked from the inside. Now, I don't know if this is a DS port of the original game, in which case you're probably all shouting at me, saying, well, you don't play it like that. Use a lockpick. Do, I don't even, I don't have a lockpick, do I? No, I've only got fade spray and a gun. So... It must be... Well, I must have to go back to where I've come from then. So, the... Um, the Mister has just released... Um, PlayStation 1 emulation. So, at some point, once I get my Barry? capture card... In, sorry, she's talking. I'll get back to you in a sec. What is... Yeah, go on then, mate. You do that. I've already shot one. What is it? Kenneth was killed too. Maybe by this creature. No, because we shot it. Anyway, let's report this to Wesker. Does that mean back the way we've come? Yeah, it looks like I'm doing a three-point turn. With, but with with Jill, um. So yeah, I've, once I get my capture card sorted out and found a way of being able to play those games over there, um, and still see what you're seeing here, uh, then maybe we can do some PlayStation as well. But I can only emulate 
mostly only 8 and 16 bit. There are some. I can do N64, but it's a bit buggy. Wesker! Oh, Wesker's Help me look for him, gone. Jill. And don't leave this hall for the time being. Okay, but I can see something flashing on the table. Nope, that way. There's no time to check it. What? Don't want to check it. Just give it me. Come on. You're joking, aren't you? Come on. Oh, but it's shining. Why is it shining if you're not like going to let me have a look? Oh, oh, I'm walking. Oh, three point turn again. It's really difficult to see what's going on on such a small screen way in the distance. Why does it not? Especially when you can't get it the right way. Look, look, it's walking backwards again. Beep, 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 beep. Jill Valentine. The th oh, now she's gone behind the post. I've got no idea where she is. Oh. Where did you come from? Find anything, Jill? Nope. Nothing. What is this all about? I can't figure it out at all. Beats me too. I'm tired and I'm just plain scared. I don't know what's going on. Well, it can't be helped. Let's search for him separately. I'll check the dining room again. Okay. I'll try the door on the opposite side. This mansion is gigantic. We could get into trouble if we get lost. It's gigantic, and we've we only looked in the red and the green floor. sections. Um. Okay, and Jill, here's a lockpick. It might oh. be handy oh. if you, lock the pick. master of unlocking, take it with you. Thanks. Thanks, Gov. Maybe I'll need it. You definitely need it. You've already been told. Listen, if something happens. Let's meet up in this hall. This time I'll be there. All right, Michael Jackson. Just look over your shoulder, honey. Stop walking backwards. Is the time to check the shiny thing now? Before I turn you off? The ink ribbon. Yeah, yeah, I'll take it. But it won't matter because I'm done with Resident Evil. I'm sure you are too. Uh, especially on the DS. DS! I ask you. Oh. So we're going to switch back to our super duper retro telly. And we're going to move on to our next game. Uh, requested last episode when um, we found out we were doing horror games yes we're moving to the Sega Mega Drive and we're going to be playing um, a version of Ghostbusters so there are some versions of Ghostbusters which are almost like a role-playing game. They're all complicated. Not 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 complicated to play, just not for this show, I felt. Um, but then I found this one. So we could do some Ghostbusters for our super fan and moderator, Nutty Cluster. Um, so let me... Um, let me get that hijacked for you. That way, let's try this way. For God's sake. There it is. Okay, that'll probably do it. Um 
I suppose you should press the start button, ready? Right. Okay, so. I think we should probably just play normal, normal. Don't you? To start with. Press trigger. Oh, okay. Y button on my controller. Recently, there's been a lot of ghost activity happening here and there. Here and there. Ooh, I felt that skip to load when I pressed the button once. Okay. I see. Right, so we pick. Tables move by themselves and shelves. Shelves fly around in the house. Not stuff on the shelves. Whoa. You see? Why why did it all skip? I didn't see that. Uh -uh. What have we got? Oh! Okay, so that's that. Jump. Oh, so the bottom button on the diamond doesn't do anything. Right. Don't need to get that. No, it's gone. Go! Can't make that. Oh! Self spawning. No, I'm stuck. Wish I could see what was down there. Um, am I trapped now? That'll be annoying. And this ghost doesn't want it. Look, it's not touching me, and... Do we have a problem? Or is it a puzzle? I don't think it's a puzzle. I think I've got a, a problem. I'm going to have to kill myself. Oh no. Okay, so I don't have any of those options. And all I can do is keep killing myself. There's no way out. Oh, okay. Well, do you know what we're going to do? We're going to restart it. Okay, so, uh, chat room. Wanted Egon. So it gives us the uh, the chance to uh, to Egon, doesn't it? You can you can get some Egon. Okay, so try the goggles on. Oh, okay. Oh, so if I press a different button, then. Um, we get to see all, all the words. Uh, right. Well, this one looks the easiest, doesn't it? So let's try this one again. Actually, no. Let's try this one. Leave it to the Ghostbusters. Let's have a look. Ah, <sighs> right. Try 
jump. Shoot. Oh, I shouldn't have fired that one. Oh. Okay, so I can't get any further that direction. It's time to go upwards, isn't it? Oh, I keep forgetting that I'm doing my jump button. Oh, done it again. Used the palmy bombs. Stupid head. It's because it's got different controls. So, um, chat room wanted me to try the goggles on. Don't think I can. It seems to be an option. Select don't do anything. Oh. Doesn't seem to be a way of doing it. I'm guessing that I wanted that blue thing. How disappointing. come from no leave me alone am I back where I started oh fuck off Feels like I am. I feel like I'm going around in circles. You can't just keep walking under and let them jump over you. this okay um do i do i oop. if it got you once i should leave you alone action start what's that Better weapons. Do I, where's it? Oh, I've got 900 quid. I ain't getting any better weapons. Let's do an action start instead. Oh, it just means start where you are. Start the action. Is that what it means? Oh, 
Oh, no, no, no. Wrong button. Wrong button. Shit bag. I think before I was pro on packing the money and burning it up. That's bad, that. Come to daddy. Whoa, what? Two of them? Don't know if they're gonna come there they are. Good job I waited. Go on, what are you gonna do now? I knew it! Shit bags. Oh, this is where we talked about patience. As in, I don't have any. Okay. Ah, oh, energy. Right, so. How do I see if there's anything off here? Can I just jump off or do I have to walk back down? And if I walk back down, are we going to get bloody monsters again? What's the point in killing them if you're going to just let them... Okay. I mean, I'm not blaming the joypad, and I could perhaps change the um, things, but it's the jumps in a different place. Oh. Guess I'm gonna run out of oxygen at some point. Because everything else is so realistic. I think we'll go down the uh, staircase, do you think? Oh. Bugger. Oh. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna... Oh. How much shooting is this gonna take? Maybe they're not meant to be um, killed. Took a lot of shooting then, it didn't die. I mean, it will surprise you to know that I've got no idea where I'm going. I feel I've been, been here before. Uh, what we might say is when we die, we're dead. No, I recognise these ones. Oh, we're dead. But they got that world's Ghostbusters on the Mega Drive. Okay. So, fulfilled my contractual obligation um, to my moderator. Uh, now we're staying with um, Mega Drive and we're going to play 
Zombies ate my neighbours. Except I feel the whole point of the game is not to let the zombies eat your neighbours. But we shall see. Oh, it's Lucas Arts. Right. Start. What's going to go on here then? <coughs> Excuse me. Oh. I can play as a lady. I'm a lady. Is it going to just let us start? Alrighty. Rescuing the neighbourhood. Zombie panic. What's going to happen now? What have we got? Okay. So. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. I guess you have to collect. Uh, oh, what's going on here? Wow. I have a water issue with the emulation. All right. Weird. Is there anything in... Oh, I did collect something. Right. What else do I need to collect? Oh! So I wonder what I'm supposed to be firing then. Oh, we might have to restart this game. No. I guess I need a key for that then. I tell you what, I'm going to restart it because it's not acting like it should. Um, I wonder if there's maybe a different version. Let's, uh, let's have a quick look for you. Zuffer Zombie. Zombie, 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 eh, 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 oh, oh, oh. Right. Let's see what we get with this one. And obvs. You need to... All right, let's have a look. Where's the screen? There it is. There you go. No, some of you missed that last time. Ah. Let's play with the fella this time. We'll always go back to the girl if need be. Everything's samey so far. This is a different ROM. Um, oh. right, that looks better, doesn't it? Ah, oh, look. So, it seems to me the idea is to stop the neighbours, uh, stop the zombies, I mean, from eating the neighbours by, I don't know, walking over them. 
Not very good at shooting them, though. Okay, so... Where's next? I assume we're looking at the nine square... Uh, map. And if we... Yeah, dog. Cheerleaders. We should always collect the cheerleaders. Save the cheerleader and all that. Can't get in that one, though. So we use the key to save the other. Who have we got left? Oh, I see another key. Yep. Well, let me pick it up, though. Oh, yeah, it will now. I think I can get out of here. This is probably not a great place to be if you want to avoid zombies. Oh, how do I get out? Ooh. So where do I need to go? I assume I need to go to the um the door that's locked. But I don't don't know what's in it. There aren't any yellow dots on my map that suggest I need to get anybody. Oh, nope. Don't want to go that way. <laughs> Only close quarter guns then by the sounds of it. Um... <clears throat> All right, let's go back to where we started then and see what happens. Ah, we... What? Did we forget one? Just one. There we go. Yes, that's right, chat room. I am in grave danger. Oh, the pain. The pain. Good job you're here. Where else would the comedy come from? Evening of the undead. Doesn't look very evening to me. Or am I speaking too soon? Do we think it's better to avoid these? Than shoot them. Is there a cheerleader? Come with me, love. Do, 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 do. Is there anyone in the pool? What are you doing in the pool at this time, mate? I know you got a little crucifix tattoo and shit, but don't make you a tough guy. You get cold. Alright. Uh, money. How do I get out? Is that it? Okay. Oh. Beer. Possibly not. Okay. So how am I supposed... How am I going to... Gotcha. Okay. I've not got a key yet, have I? So I need to find a key on every... Level? Why let me walk behind here if there's nothing for me to pick up? Oh no, I didn't want to do that. Oh, naughty cluster, don't take the ump. It's not like you. I don't know how to get out of this bit. Well, there's a key. Oh no, can't get to it from here. So... How am I supposed to get in there? Oh! I had him then and all. Sh 
shit bag. Dot spots, I can swim in that either. I imagine it's not very good for me. Whoa, 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 run away, run away, run away. Oh, how am I gonna save the cheerleader, save the world? No, no, stop eating people. Right. Get you. Get out. How am I going to get around there? Oh, door's open. Don't leave the door open with the baby in the house. Jeez. Right. Well, I felt there was more people to get, but I'm going to take the exit. Don't look a gift horse in the mouth. Yeah, yeah, some people got eaten. Mistakes were made. Terror in aisle five. We're going to be in a shop. Yeah. Get off! Bastards. No, 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 no. That's better. Right. Ah, oh, people are dying all over the place. Are they, are they all people I'm... <sighs> Don't get me wrong, I like a zombie in a shopping mall. Help. Hey! Shit face. Is, is he a bad guy then? I thought it was somebody I had to get. Alright, we have to avoid them. They're bad. Uh, somebody in this top corner, who's that? Where are they? They're in this next shot, I believe. Run away, run away, avoid, avoid. Oh, no. You threw that. Yeah, bastard. Okay. That, get that baby, don't. Perhaps get some of that. Can we get... You're not going to come out, eh, you little rebel scumbags? Nope! Too much heat in there. Woo ha ha. Right, we need. No, we need somebody who's over. Hmm. Don't know. Ah, that shop. Okay. Okay. How many more? Does it tell me? Whoa. Guess it's, whoa. Nope. Let's go this way. Oh, there's somebody up there. Somebody. Somebody in here. No. I think they're. Oh, that was that person I couldn't get because I don't have a key. Oh. Um. Find the key. Oh, don't throw it through the hole. Back off. Oh, this is going to end badly for me, isn't it? If I'm not careful. Um... No, dead end. Oh, shit. Go away. Looks like he's peeing up the wall. Right, how do I get around there then? Oh, game making me think. <sighs> so, I wonder if I have to go round the back of a shot. Oh, I can't shoot them either. Oh, yeah, I can. But they can hoof me. Oh, 
Right, so, ah! Hello? Hello, key! So, where does that... Can I get round here to the cheerleader? No. Let's keep going. I got some lollipops. And then I can shoot. Ah, there we go. Cheerleader. Oh, and that was it. All right. Again, gift horse mouth. Let's do it. Okay, I do feel that this could be a game that I would come back to again and again. Or a few times, maybe. Um, the Wumberjack Hedge Maze Mayhem. That sounds like three random words, doesn't it? Oh, I see. F that off. Come on, run away. Hey, this could be uh, Houston. No, no, no. No, no, no. Oh, you can't. They're really difficult to kill. Oh, they don't stay dead either. And they're quite tenacious. You know what I was saying about playing this more often? Yeah, I don't think it will be. It's got too difficult now. Oh. The F off. I wonder if I've... Have I got a bigger a weapon? Lots of hedge maze-ness going on. People will die. Because I can't find my way around. See? That one there. Come here, come here. Open that. I mean, the only good thing is the top and the stop and have a swing every now and again. He's gonna go up and kill that baby. Don't kill the baby. Not until I get there. Oh no, that didn't sound right. Oh, shit, how am I gonna get in there? These can't kill these. You can't kill these. Oh. Kill one right in front of my face. <laughs> naughty, naughty lumberjacks. Or Jason, as we call him. Oh, I don't think I need to leave my name. Oh, there's the Mr. Oh, I like that. I'd spell my name there for a minute. That's me, Mr. Math. I'm right at the top as well. Oh, look at that. Somebody else who played it previously was called Mark. Well, beat his score. Uh, right, okay, there you go. Zombies ate my neighbours. And then homicidal axe-wielding maniacs chop them up in a hedge. And what we're going to do... Oh, we're going to switch screens. Okay. So, because it's not uh, here yet, there it is. Um, so welcome to the end of the show. Um, for the, for you, you YouTube people, there was um, a glitch, we might say, as my machine crashed. Um, so there'll have been a big edit just then, a really weird edit where it would look like I'm in the middle of a game and then all of a sudden we're on this screen. Um, and, you, yeah, I don't know, you missed 20 minutes or so. Um, which would say, suggest that if you joined us on twitch.tv slash snugradio, 
then you would still have seen a little bit of the game. But once we edit it together, sorted. Um, right, so we're on the wheel. It's the wheel where we spin and find out what we're going to do next week. Ah, right. Um, but we're 11 episodes in. You know what they all are by now. And more importantly, once it lands on something, I'll tell you. Um, so, let's spin the wheel. Pinball! Okay, so um, next week, in fact, we might be revisiting Sonic Pinball. Who knows? But we're going to play um, pinball games. Okay. Right. I know we've won a two. It might be a short show. We might have a, a random section at the end, depending. Um, but, uh, yeah, okay. Pinball. Pinball it is, right. Super, let's switch back to this one then. Um, uh, what would that look like now? Yeah, let's bring it to the top, don't we? Like that. Um, because that's it. That's the end of episode 11. Horror. Ooh. And um, so if you, if you want to follow us, uh, that would be great. Follow us on Twitch. And um, subscribe would be nice if you've got a Prime subscription. That would be handy. It would help us grow. Um, and if you're watching us on YouTube, please uh, um, subscribe and and comment. You know, if you've got um, any horror games for our next episode, which we'll probably say for Halloween. But if you've got any horror games in the 16, 18, 16 bit area era, then um, let us know. Drop us a comment. You can always email us, if you like, retro at snugradio.co.uk. That's retro at snugradio.co.uk. And we're also on TikTok. Yes, uh, Nutty Cluster, our moderator, runs our TikTok for us. And it would be great if you um, if you blasted that out and uh, saw little snippets of what you've been seeing tonight, really. Um, retro Lounge is every Monday at 7 o'clock on Twitch. But you can join us on Tuesdays and Fridays for Elevenses, where we play two hours of uh, easy listening or whatever I fancy uh, from 11 till 1 to ease you into lunchtime. Uh, that's Tuesdays and Fridays here on Twitch. Um, and that's it. Uh, we're on Facebook and Twitter as Snug Radio, and our website is snugradio.co.uk. So, until next week when we're doing pinball, it's goodbye from me. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs>